Boris Johnson's government's constant fighting with the EU is meant to energise the Brexit electoral base, an LBC caller claimed, UK ministers are reportedly drafting a list of European Union regulations to be repealed this year and also launching a post-Brexit review on how traders can sell products using imperial measurements. With those proposals, Boris Johnson's government is playing politics to remind voters of a fictitious war with the EU and keep the electoral base alive. An LBC caller argued. Elaborating on his theory, LBC caller Ben said, I think the reason they do this stuff is not, it's to have this continuous war of attrition with Brussels. To make it look like we're always fighting with the EU. I don't think they want to get Brexit done. I think the purpose of this kind of stuff is to sort of remind the people that voted for Brexit in the red wall seats if you like but also down south where I come from. That we're always at war with the EU, these evil puppet masters in Brussels. We must somehow be fighting them. That's why I think the Northern Ireland Protocol, I don't think they'll ever initiate the Northern Ireland Protocol, talks around the Northern Ireland Protocol reached an impasse earlier this month. After the Northern Irish elections. The unionist DUP outright rejected the formation of a power-sharing coalition with the nationalist Sinn Féin until all their concerns around the protocol were not addressed. UK Foreign Secretary Liz Truss tried to start talks with EU's Brexit Commissioner Maro Sefcovic who refused to renegotiate the protocol but came up with a series of proposals. Secretary Truss then upped the ante by announcing a new plan to the Commons that could scrap parts of the Northern Ireland Protocol and put the whole Brexit agreement at risk.